Hi everyone, Alison here from Starsology. This time I'm going to be talking about um, my latest new book out, um, Your Money Planets, and um, we'll be looking into that. Enjoy. Hey guys, so thanks for watching. This time I'm going to be um, discussing with you um, the second book. I've actually got it on paperback. It's been available for quite a while now on Kindle and um, it's a beautiful, we, it arrived in, um, in my unboxing, which I showed you a couple of weeks back. Um, it's quite a slim volume and it's about your money planets and it's had to do with financial astrology. So this particular um, book is, although it's aimed at astrology, it can really be understood by, dare I say, regular folk. I just want to go over a couple of the chapters that we have in it for you and you can see where, where we're going. So first up I'll be speaking about the, uh, it, it, the book will be telling you about your four money planets and what they actually mean because one doesn't just have, you might have a ruling planet which is the, the planet that rules your sign but you will also have financial planets as well and you will have four of them. Uh, and again, it depends how your actual chart works out, which will be the four money planets that affect you. And then I go into each and every sign and explain the difference, how each sign has its four different types of money planets and what they actually mean. So although you will have uh, ruling planets, you will have different planets as well. It, this will not only will I... Um, not only is this book available now, but um, I will be doing a talk at NORWAC, the Astrology Conference in Seattle, this March. Um, so I'm going to leave, read you a little piece from the uh, book. Um, There's not one method for financial for freedom that works for everyone. Some people benefit from going cold turkey and cutting up their credit cards, but that only works for a few. Others like to put in more hours at a paying job and some will create some passive income that supplements their household kitty. These are just a few examples of how to manage your money but will they work for you? On the internet there is mountains of information everywhere you and you are knee deep in financial advice tips and get rich quick schemes. Everyone you speak to has a system or method to manage their budget um, and their method may work for them but it won't necessarily work for you. What if you could see the pattern of your money, your money management through the eyes of astrology? What if you could really get to grips with what works for you and what aligns with your core beliefs as shown in your birth chart? What if you didn't have to listen to your mother-in-law telling you where you were going wrong? So this is some of the features we have in this book. Your Money Planets Astrology for Your Financial Life has been uh, created as a guide for a positive approach to your financial life with the help of astrology. It will show how a little astrological knowledge can make your life better. It shows you how to work with the planets for your financial benefit. You may know your sun sign and know that you are a Virgo or a Capricorn, but you can look deeper into your basic chart to discover the other planets that have so much to say about your financial life, and that is the benefit of this book. This book has tips on income earning, investing, spending, what to buy, what to sell, where to earn and how to save. I also want to tell you a little bit about uh, NORWAC, the astrology conference in Seattle this year. Um, mainly because I'll be speaking there, so why not? But anyway, it's, it's, I was there last year um, with my friends um, in 2017 and it was a great time was had. And um, I first went to NORWAC in 2014 when I first moved out to Vancouver. Uh, well, I didn't actually know anybody in the astrological community, and it really is a fantastic conference. It's well run by Laura, and um, they have fantastic speakers. It's mainly mainly American, which is actually natural, but she does bring in some speakers from Europe as well. So this year it's going to, um, I'll actually be talking about Your Money Planets, which is great. Um, I'll be discussing, my actual talk will be on the Sunday where this book will be available and that will be Sunday March the 25th 2018 so if you're actually watching this video after that date then gee I'm sorry <laughs> you missed it but maybe next time and that will be at 10 15 a.m the talk will be we're not exactly sure which room it will be in but anyway so if you are at Norwalk do come out reach out to me I should be arriving there on the Friday and I'll be staying until the Monday um, for the whole weekend it, it's a fabulous time this mm. lovely banquet um, it's a very good hotel um, lots of fantastic speakers and uh, friends that you, you will you will really enjoy. Um, several of my students will be going as well. So anyway, when you actually um, uh, go to these conferences, they're, they're, 
they're held in the hotel there's a shopping center across the road and um, there's many things to do as well but if you're into astrology you really do want to be networking paying attention going to the lunches going to the dinners with your notebook and everything and I'll be talking a little bit more about um, what to pack for an astrology conference later on anyway so I just wanted to let you know about my book that came out which I'm very pleased about um, your money planets Alison Price that's me um, super little handy astrology book get you into it get you into finances and everything there thank you so much have a prosperous day